so nice to be back here after not being down since summer last year was the last time I actually came down because of the second national lockdown that happened back in England and the borders were closed over here so yeah, it's so nice to be back down here on the beach and with all my mates let's get some more shots I don't know if I'll be able to get to the beach because I've just seen this whole long line with a river coming down off the sea I don't know if you can hear me that well because of the sea but I'll try and speak as loud as I can I'm going to try and get through this so I'm walking along here now I'm trying to find the most narrow area I can go across because at the moment it carries on all the way down here and it is actually quite deep and I'm not in swimming so, so I can't get through it but it is really deep <laughs> in some areas but oh, I'm going to try and get it actually I'm going to try and get across here so after being stranded here and getting across the first bit this bit is really deep again oh so I'm going to carry down even further right I've found my plan there's two islands there so I'm going to hop onto one then hop onto the other then hopefully try and hop across but yeah I've got to try and get across at some point so yeah so at the moment I've walked from one end of the beach down there where the pole is to near enough the opposite end of the beach which is up by the car park at an area like that but I wasn't planning on going this far up Managed calling me, but I wasn't planning on going this far up. But it is really nice to come across the beach on a nice day like that. I was in the sea yesterday, and it was actually quite warm. But yeah, I am across, and so let's try and get some good shots of the sea now. I don't know if you can hear, but as you can see up there, the car park is there. And I'm right outside the car park, so I have walked quite a bit from down to where the ramp is to get up here. But yeah. And now the worst part is again trying to get through this little stream that's come through. So yeah. So as you can see where I'm walking now, I'm walking down to like a rock pool area. When the tide's in a little bit further, all of this area is um, filled up with water. So you can actually come down here and do some rock pool um, stuff and you can move some of the rocks. And there are actually some crabs in here. I don't think I'm going to get any because it is quite dry down here and there's not much water. So there won't be many crabs in there. But when the tide's in again... Then this area just fill up with water and there are some crabs in there because we saw some yesterday. As I said, I don't know how well you can hear me in this video due to the wind. If it is that bad I won't be posting it, but if it, if you can hear me, I will be posting it. But as I said, it's just a bit of a change up from this YouTube video, obviously. I'll be back with doing theme park related stuff um, next week and there's a video doing about the retro squad at Alton Towers and me giving my reviews about each one and how well they fit into each themed area at the park but yeah thank you for joining me for a different clip here in Wales I will be heading home later today but yeah I'm gonna go meet up with my friends now and yeah, we're going to go and do some other stuff. I won't be recording it, obviously. But I just thought I'll get some shots of the beach over here. So yeah, thank you for joining me on an absolutely amazing sunny day here in Wales. And yeah, I will see you in my next YouTube video, which will be about the Retro Squad at Alton Towers next week. See you later.